Madam Krzyzewski. I'm a project engineer at Plants 2 and 3 for Old Pack of Foundry. Been here two and a half years. We design equipment here for either the core making, the casting process, or the cleaning process. Anything for support or the direct making of our product. It can be taking a piece of equipment we currently have, making it more efficient, or it can be installing a whole product line, maybe a core cell, which includes some automation. It could be a whole molding machine, including PMC, shakers, different types of equipment that help make our product. We do everything here as an engineer from budgeting, planning, designing. I'd say a uh, general day is two-thirds of it. You're in your office and one-third you're out on the floor. We get a project, we determine who's going to work on it. Um, sometimes we do projects by ourselves, or sometimes we do them as a team of engineers. There is uh, maintenance personnel, fabrication crews, and then we also involve production. With the design, you work with them to incorporate what they want, do it efficiently, effectively, and do it on a good budget. When you go out there, you get to meet people, you know, it's feel good when they say, hey, thanks for doing that. Thanks for, you know, making my job easier. We use Inventor for our 3D modeling. So we do a lot of 3D modeling. We also have AutoCAD 2D for plant layouts. We use ANSYS for stress analysis. We can create from scratch. We can modify existing equipment. We can rotate stuff, see if anything's interfering. Yeah, and you can also simulate certain motions or movements that the machine is going to make to see how things are going to work. Maybe there's going to be something hanging up that you got to modify, make sure it's going to work smoothly. High school, I pretty much was just looking out, see what I wanted to do, go to college. I uh, went to University of Stevens Point, went there for a year, and then I transferred to University of Wisconsin Stout, where, where I finished up my degree. I liked helping my dad around the shop, tinkering cars, building stuff. And that really helps me out here in the field because a lot of times we get on the maintenance shop or the project shop where we got to help either put something together, look at something, take something apart to see what's wrong with it. So there was a lot of experience that I could grab from back in high school, what I was doing around the shop with my dad, that I could do in the shop here at work. In high school I worked with AutoCAD on drafting and 2D computer design. And then I saw a demonstration of the 3D modeling during college and that really got me hooked. Just a little cool, you know, you get to see everything and what you see on the screen is eventually what you see out on the floor. You know, very hands-on out here. I worked on installing robots, working on robot tooling. One project I worked on, we actually were able to cut 20 seconds out of a cycle time. So going from, let's say, a minute down to 40 seconds. That's huge, and then it also makes it safer for the workers, you know, less injuries, makes everybody else go home safe. It's great to work in the foundry. We keep it very clean. We get a lot of compliments on how clean our facility is. Here at Wapaka Foundry, we're continually to improve, make the working conditions better, safer for everybody. We like to include automation as best as we can, and we look for that for future projects. I think there's a lot of room for advancement. There's a lot of career opportunities. If the individual is willing, ambitious, and shows the need and the want to advance, they can. There are endless possibilities. If you're in high school right now and you think engineer would be a good opportunity for you or something you would like to look at, a few classes to take would be any drafting or 3D modeling classes, any math classes, technology classes, shop classes, welding. You need to be self-motivated, good mechanical aptitude, you need to be a good team player. Every project, you're working with a team. You also have to understand different personalities in order to work with different people. In high school, I wasn't aware that there was any engineering positions here at Wapaka Foundry. And through the college summers that I worked here, I was able to discover that there were many engineering jobs here. And I was also had the opportunity to do an internship here for a summer. Well, Packet Foundry plays a big part in the local communities. They very much promote from within and from the communities. Yeah, it's cool, it's exciting, I love it. There's different challenges every day. I have two small kids, I get to see my family. I'm gonna see my wife's family. We get to you know, come home every day. And this is where I grew up. I thought I had to move to a larger city in order to get opportunities in engineering, but I was able to find a place here at Wapaka Foundry to call home.